NCM Learning Center. Good morning, friends. In this video, first I am going to discuss about what is face margin and what is gain margin. Then I will discuss the formulas, face margin and the gain margin calculation formula and its justification. How this formula derived? Okay. The third, we will discuss some problems uh, in the gate IAS examinations uh, from face margin and gain margin calculations. Okay. Fourth, I will show some questions. Uh, from the previous year uh, common examinations questions. First, we will discuss uh, the definition, basic definition of base margin and gain margin. Before that, uh, stability condition. What, what is the stability condition? Uh, let us take an open loop system, JWS with unity feedback, HFS. Okay. Uh, if you know the open loop system uh, and HFS, what will be the closed loop system? The closed system is uh, JWS due to be 1 plus JWS and HFS because the feedback is unity negative feedback okay so the closed system will become jfs to be one plus jfs and hfs this basic one okay when the closed system will be an unstable one definitely we can say that when the system the closed denominator part the denominator part is equal to zero uh, the whole time will be an infinite one so we may say definitely the closed system will be an unstable one when the denominator part of the system is zero so the condition for the closed system is unstable is uh, 1 plus gfs hfs is equal to 0. Okay, so we may write gfs in hfs is equal to minus 1. Minus 1 means uh, magnitude is 1, phase angle is minus 180. So we may write gfs in hfs is equal to 1 at an angle of minus 180. Okay, this is the condition for the system is closed system will be unstable one. The open loop system magnitude is 1 at an phase angle is minus 180 degree. Definitely this part will be 0. So the definitely the closed system will be an unstable one. Okay, this is a criteria. This is the condition stability criteria. Okay, so from that we may define uh, phase margin and gain margin. Before that, uh, the phase crossover frequency and gain crossover frequency is de defined by using the stability criteria. Phase crossover frequency means frequency at which the phase angle is minus one degree. Okay, gain crossover frequency means uh, frequency at which the gain is unity okay this the relation the two parameter is defined by using the stability condition okay so next we will discuss uh, the basic definition of phase margin and gain margin gain margin gain margin is uh, amount of additional gain is required an open loop system at a phase angle of minus 180 degree to make the closed system is unstable. This is the definition. Uh, clearly, uh, try to understand the definition. Okay. So, uh, let us, we know that the stability condition, the open loop system, magnitude is unity at, at a phase angle is minus 180 degree, then definitely the closed loop system will be unstable one. Let us take open loop system. The open loop system magnitude is some some op, magnitude is somewhat x okay at an angle phase angle of minus 180 degree. Some amount of gain, additional gain is required to make this gain is unity. That means to make the closed system is unstable. That gain is called as gain margin. Okay. So from this definition, we may rewrite as an equation open loop gain at minus 180 degree. It may be somewhat x value, it's maybe is 1 or may not be 1. Okay, uh, we, we have to add some gain, additional gain to make the closed system is unstable. Okay, uh, this is a definition by the definition we may rewrite, we may rewrite like this. Okay, so where here open loop gain, we know that open loop gain is a mass of j of j omega h of j omega. Open loop gain in decibel is equal to 20 lakh. We go we will multiply 20 lakh, 20 lakh into mass of J of J and H of J mega. Open loop gain at minus 1 degree. Minus 1 degree is mean phase class or frequency. Magnitude at phase class or frequency. So 20 lakh of mass of J of J omega BC and H of J omega BC. It, it means that magnitude in dB at phase class or frequency at minus 1 degree. Okay. Additional amount means gain margin. Some additional amount means that gain margin. Okay. Gain to make the closed system unstable is unity. If if open loop gain is unity at a phase angle of minus one degree, the closed loop will closed loop system will become unstable. So uh, the gain to make the closed system unstable is unity. 
it means as zero decibel it is equal to zero decibel unity gain means zero decibel total lag of one is equal to zero zero okay substitute in this equation so total lag of minus of jj omega bc has jj omega bc plus additional amount gain margin is equal to zero decibel so gain margin is equal to minus total lag of minus of jj omega bc in jj omega bc this is the equation this is a gain margin equation okay if the feedback is unity gain margin is equal to minus only log of mole of jj omega bc okay this is a equation final equation this is the justification for the gain margin equation gain of open loop system is 20 log of mole of jj omega the gain of open loop system at minus 180 degree is equal to 20 log of mole of jj omega bc okay some amount of additional gain we have to add to make the open loop gain is 0 decibel how much gain we have to add minus 20 log we have to add minus 20 log of minus of j j omega bc we have to add then only the open loop system will become 0 decibel okay so the gain margin is equal to minus 20 log of minus of j j omega bc okay phase margin is defined as the amount of additional negative phase angle is required for an open loop system at unity gain to make the closed system unstable okay already we know that condition for the unstable is uh matter should be one and phase angle at, at the same time the phase angle should be minus 180 degree otherwise at unity gain or zero decibel gain the phase angle should be minus 180 degree okay let us take an open loop system uh, at unity gain the phase angle may be minus 150 degree so to make minus 150 into minus 180 uh, to unstable we got to add 30 degree negative 30 degree we have to add so the phase margin is 30 like this okay so uh, from this equation we may rewrite open loop phase angle at unity gain plus additional amount of phase is equal to phase angle to make the closed system unstable okay um, by the definition we may rewrite okay so open loop at phase angle is uh, phase angle is equal to by is equal to angle of j j minus j j minus Phase angle at unity gain, unity gain gain plus frequency by GC. So your angle of the geometric GC in a geometric GC. Phase angle at gain plus frequency. Okay. The additional amount is phase margin, negative phase margin, because the phase margin is additional of negative phase angle. Here this is a positive phase angle, but phase margin the definition by the definition addition of negative phase angle. So uh, the additional amount of phase is a negative phase margin. Okay. A phase margin is equal to addition of negative addition, negative addition. So uh, minus comma phase margin is the person that by minus comma. Okay, phase margin is the person by comma. Okay, this so minus defined is an addition of negative phase angle. Okay, uh, phase angle to make the closed system unstable is minus one degree. Let me know. So substitute in this equation. So by GC, open up at gain the surface frequency at unity gain by GC, additional amount minus Phase margin is equal minus 180. So we may rewrite this equation. Phase margin is equal 180 plus pi gc. This is a def equation. Phase margin equation. The phase margin equation is de is derived from the definition. Okay. If you clearly understand the derivation, we may we may write this equation. Phase margin equation. Okay. This is a just derivation for the equation. Okay. Now we will discuss some problems. Uh, from the phase margin gain margin uh, okay the first problem uh, we have to calculate the phase margin the transformation of the system is given this question is asked in gate 2018 we know that phase margin uh, comma is equal to 180 plus by gc if you know by gc Phase angle at gain goes over frequency. Then only we can calculate the phase margin. So first we go to find the phase angle at gain goes over, gain goes over frequency. What is my phase angle? Phase angle for this equation we may write phase angle for this equation is uh, minus sine of omega minus sine of omega by two. Already we know. Already we already I already I explained how to calculate the phase angle for the given transformation. Just refer this video. Okay. So phi gc phase angle gain goes over frequency is equal to minus sine of omega gc minus sine of omega gc by two. Okay, uh, if you know the omega gc, then only we can find the phi gc. Okay, first try to find the omega gc. Add some omega gc. Omega gc means frequency at which the magnitude is unity. 
okay so find the magnitude mass of jeep jemega is equal to due to root of omega square plus 1 into root of omega square plus 4 this is magnitude at unity magnitude the frequency is gain plus frequency so equate the magnitude is 1 unity at the time the frequency is gain plus frequency because by the definition we know that fre frequency at which the magnitude is unity okay at unity gain the frequency is gain plus frequency okay so simply with this equation uh, 2 is equal to omega g square plus 1 into root of omega g square plus 4 squared on both sides you will get this answer simplify this equation we will get this answer omega g is c is over 4, 4 plus pi omega g square is equal to 0 further simplify this equation you will get omega g is equal to 0 gain plus frequency is equal to 0 substitute in this equation to get the by gc if we know by gc then only we can find the phase margin so substitute in the equation tangent of 0 is equal to 0 so by gc is equal to 0 ok so phase margin is equal to 180 plus 0 0 180 the answer is 180 ok the second question object is to find the gain margin of the system the transaction is given uh, gain margin is equal to minus 20 log of modulus of j of j omega of c from this equation first we go to find the omega bc then magnitude magnitude of mass of j omega bc finally gain margin okay so uh, omega bc is a phase cross frequency frequency at which the phase angle is minus 18 degree okay so find the phase angle for the system equate the phase angle to minus 18 degree we will get the omega bc okay so uh, phase angle pi is equal to minus 90 one, yes minus 90 minus 90 so omega by 9 minus 90 so omega by 25 okay this is the phase angle for this transmission. Okay. Equate this phase angle to minus 180 degree, then only we can get the phase cross frequency. So equate to minus 180. Now the frequency will phase cross frequency. Okay. Simplify uh, this equation minus minus n is equal to minus n so omega base by 9, minus n so omega base by 25. Multiply by minus on both sides. So we will get 90 is equal to dynamics of this answers. Multiply by tan on both sides. So tan. 90 is equal to tan of this one. We know that tan A plus B is equal to tan A plus tan B divided by 1 minus tan A tan B. Okay, substitute in this equation. Tan 90, tan 90 is equal to sin 90 by cos 90, sin 90 1 cos 90 0. Sin tan 90 is infinite. So we may write uh, tan 90 as sin 90 by cos 90, sin 90 by 1 cos 90 value 0, 1 by 0 infinity. Okay, so tan 90 is infinity, so 1 by 0. Tan A, tan into tan A of omega B is by 9. So tan tan inverse will cancel, we will get omega B is by 9. Tan B, tan tan inverse cancel, we will get omega B is by 25. So we will get this answer. Okay. Cross multiply this equation, we will get 1 minus omega square B is by 25 is equal to 0. We will get. So the answer base cross of frequency is equal to 15 radian per seconds. Okay. Next, we have to find the magnitude at omega PC. Okay, magnitude for the system is uh, 150 divided by root of 150 divided by omega into root of omega square plus 9 square into omega square plus 25 square. Because magnitude for a plus jb time is equal to root of a square plus p square. Okay, uh, find the ma magnitude at base cross frequency. Substitute omega base cross frequency value. So 150 divided by 15 in root of 15 square plus 9 square into root of 15 square plus 25 square. The magnitude at phase cross frequency is 0 0.096. Okay, now find the gain, mar gain margin minus 20 log of this value minus 20 log of 0 0.096 is equal to 34.15. Option C is correct. Okay, this is a calculation for the gain margin. Remember that for the calculation of phase cross frequency, find the phase angle. Equate the phase angle equation to minus 1 degree, we will get the phase cross frequency. For the calculation of gain cross frequency, find the gain and equate the gain equation to unity, we will get the gain cross frequency. Okay. Then do it yourself. First question objective is to find the gain margin and phase margin of the gain margin and phase margin of the system. This question is asked in Tamil Nadu Electricity Board Australian Engineering Examinations EC 2018. Okay. Second question, objective of the question is find the gain margin equation. This question is asked in Tamil Nadu Electricity Board Examinations 2018 Instrumentation Department. Okay. 
third question phase margin of the system is used to specify which of the following is the frequency response relative stability absolute stability time response time response is not correct okay frequency response also not correct maybe the answer is relative stability or absolute stability okay this question is asked in tamil nadu district board engineering assessment examination question 8 in instrumentation engineering department okay fourth one the typical specification for design stipulate the gain margin and phase margin to be respectively okay this question is asked in tamil nadu district board assessment examinations instrumentation question submitted okay try to solve this four questions come on your answers if you not able to solve this problem just wait i will upload the next videos for solution videos okay thank you thanks for watching click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon for notification like comment and share